Lufthansa Aviation Training, we train the future young pilots for Swiss and Edelweiss at our home base training airport in Grenchen. We use the Diamond DA42 specifically for our training. It's in instruments, rating and as well on multi-engine. Unfortunately, sometimes due to the weather you cannot fly and we have been always interested in looking into future solutions. What can we do when we are not able to fly or out of sustainability or environmental areas as well? That's why we came up with the idea if it's possible to have some sort of simulator available where we can fly all the time 24-7 and with every weather. Of course, there is as well a financial benefit behind. It's cheaper to fly an hour in a simulator than compared to an aircraft. But in the end, we have to do the training on the real aircraft as well, because the simulator is quite close, but it cannot represent the aircraft in full reality. For Lufthansa aviation training, it's specifically important that we can keep up with the developments. That means we have to teach the young generation with newer technologies. It's a different way how they learn today compared to previous times. My name is Daniel Jäger. I'm a theoretical knowledge instructor at the Lufthansa Aviation Training Pilot School in Switzerland. And I'm as well responsible for the mixed reality simulator, which we will introduce in future in our training program. We do the training for the young generation for the future Swiss and Edelweiss pilots. Our head of pilot school wanted to see what is possible in our flying school. So he started the technology project with the great partners with Brunner and Vario. And in the end, it was way better than actually expected. So we can consider in the future a possible certification and may replace our standard FNPTs. For us, it was very important to get mixed reality because we wanted to go one step further. They can touch the switches from the regular cockpit. They can use their knee board. They can write down clearances. When we're then looking into the virtual world, which is around, I have a huge advantage compared to normal simulators. I have a 360 degree view available. Wherever I look, I can see something. There's no limitation compared to other regular flight simulators of uh, 180 degrees, as example. What is the difference between virtual reality and mixed reality? You can imagine, you look outside, you see a virtual world around you, and now with the mixed reality, specifically with the Vario XR3 Focal Edition, we have these two cameras, so those ones are actually filming my whole cockpit which I have inside. So I can see my hands touching the buttons as well. I can see everything very clear and I can read all the numbers from the Garmin 1000 as I would have in real life without the goggles. How do we see the future at Lufthansa Aviation Training? With the NovaSim MR and the Varia XR3 Focal Edition, we have great tools available which we will integrate in our syllabus. We can see clearly the future into mixed reality, where we can use it in training with the young generation, where they will reach their targets quicker, more professional, and at a lower cost, and of course, more environmental friendly.